So the good folks at HTC just warned me that I'm going to look like a really ill Martian putting myself in front of this backdrop with all the green light. But you know, it's all in the name of visual creativity. Uh, that's why I review phones and I'm not a cinematographer. What's up? I'm at the HTC booth at CTA Wireless in Las Vegas, which can only mean one thing. We're here to get our snap on. I'm going to get out of the way of the light now so you can see. It's the new HTC Snap Windows Mobile 6.1 smartphone. It's very thin. It's got the new HTC design language on this year's releases. We saw the Diamond 2 and the Touch Pro 2 at World Congress in Barcelona in February and uh, also the Magic uh, for Vodafone. And you know, this new kind of curved language, a little more refined. I personally like it. I know that the Diamond faceted back on the original Diamond was a big hit with a lot of people. But I kind of like the smooth curve stuff. So I'm, I'm into the new HTCs. The snap is very thin. It's uh, been announced only in an unlocked, unbranded form format, I should say, version. So no uh, no news on a U.S. carrier. Uh, if you're into rumors, well, you can do that on your own time. But uh, it's got a 528 megahertz Qualcomm processor inside, 256 megabytes of ROM, 192 megabytes of RAM. It, uh, it's less than a half an inch thick, two megapixel camera on the back. It's uh, GSM, like I said, with uh, HSDPA, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, AGPS, you know, all the, uh, all the usual suspects. Specs. You've got this jog ball on the front, so you can go through your Windows Mobile menu there and scroll side to side. The jog ball feels nice. It's a nice size, easy to click. Uh, and the new feature here, in addition obviously to just the hardware, is the inner circle feature, which uh, this little green circular button down there. And you can set it up so that you can add up to uh, five email accounts. And basically you'll just get a special custom <laughs> notification when you get messages from these people. So that, uh, you know, they HTC did some research and they found that for all the crazy connectedness that we all have, we really only most of us care about the messages we get from five or fewer people. So, you know, they're, they're trying to make life easy for you with the uh, the inner circle there. And I'll tell you, I said, you know, there's no carrier news, but wouldn't inner circle go nice with my faves on T-Mobile? I don't know. Anyway, there you go. It's the HTC Snap. Uh, also, should say I had a chance yesterday to play with this a little bit. And uh, the keyboard's nice. The button's a uh, nice dome feel to them. Uh, it's a four row QWERTY, nice big space bar, offset, so uh, HTC's new, the Touch Pro 2 also had an offset keyboard, which I really like. And uh, you know, a little close together in terms of uh, space between the keys, but the domed factor, uh, the domed shape of the keys seems to make up for it, and the key travel is really nice. So there you go, the HTC Snap, maybe we'll see it soon in uh, carrier branding, I don't know, but for now uh, there's going to be a release of this phone, the Snap will be released when shipping sometime, do we know? Second quarter in Europe. Second quarter of this year in Europe, you probably heard him say that, so uh, and hopefully a US release to follow, alright? So there you go, from the HTC booth in crazy, crazy Las Vegas. I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com. Much more from the show on PhoneDog.com.